Hi, welcome to a super quick footnote from part three. Uh, so someone asked in my code, when I moved my card from the deck to where I wanted my hand, why I didn't use the tween functions. So for those who don't know, tweens is basically Godot's built-in way to handle movements of whether it's card, objects, whatever. Uh, to basically enable it, you just go to your root node, you add a child node, and you just add a tween there. And once that tween's been added, and then enables a bunch of script you can use to do a lot of fancy movements fairly straightforward. Just quickly to say the advantages and disadvantages of this. Uh, first things first, the current code, all my movements just hands on a single line. If I jump to the code where I've got tween in working, you basically need a few more lines of code. It's not a huge difference in terms of readability, at least at this prototyping stage, it can be easy to have a really concise code. On the pluses of tweening, we now have a lot more control. There are basically certain functions you can use in tweenings. If you go to easins.net, there's like a really good list of what the easins functions look like and how they behave. Okay, so for example, ease in out cubic over here, if I hover over it, let me just zoom in first, you can see it starts gradual, speeds up, and then slows down again. So that can look fairly nice with card draws, so we can actually see what it looks like right now in code. So here I've got tween, I've picked cubic, and I want ease in and out. And if I run that, you can see that when you draw cards, it's a bit more gradual. So again, for your card game, you might prefer that. Uh, another one, just show them works. If I enable this line instead, you have a different type of tweening. So if you want to, feel free to play with them. It can be quite fun. Uh, best what I've been doing is just start a new code. You know, basically have all the options there for what type of tweening you want to play around with. And you've also you've wanted to ease in and out, which basically do you want it to start nicely or end nicely? But you can also to delete that just to skip that part. Okay, hope that was very useful. And I'll see you shortly for part four.